Stay a while and listen. Hello, welcome back to The Freak Show. Bumpy McSquiggums here. I want to thank you all for joining me as I continue with my Let's Play of Disgaea 1 Complete. This is Etna Mode. And we're up against Angel, Trainee, Flan, and we're about to do the battles, the murders, the kills. She is uh, apparently infested with some sort of dark aura from a tome slash book. That good old quote-unquote god, a.k.a. Volcanus, of the, the bad guy... Um, yeah, so she's she's not in her right mind. She's a bit more powerful. She is not even flan anymore. She is dark flan. It's uh yeah, it's scary. All right, let's go. Let's get this done. Come on. Oh dear. Oh, just on you. Okay, no, that's fine. I'm sixty percent sure you don't die to that. Yeah. 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 We'll feel it's fine. I'm giving my wall. Mhm. Mm ha. Ah. Ah. I was say, where's Zap? I see Zap. Zap is cool. He's he's in a good spot. All right, let's go ahead and do this. Fifteen hundred. That was uh not too shabby, if I do say so myself. All right, Angel Trainee Flan, if that is your real name, we're gonna come over here. It's not. No, it's fine. It's dark Flan. Over here, we're gonna punch you and then slap you back. You're going to be put down into the ground. And that's not a whole lot of damage done to you just yet. It's okay. We're just kind of starting our heavy hitting here. Let's go ahead with Wind Cutter. We'll move forward. We will do Bullet Storm. Oh, well, we were in spot four Bullet Storm already. Well. Let's see if we can drop you down under the 10k mark. 1700's not bad. Oh, he's a bit underwhelming this time around. It's alright. Where'd that put you? Uh, 1100, it's, well, we're getting there. We're getting there. Alright, I am probably going to slap you around a little bit. Just so you know. Wind cutter. And... Oh, we're not done yet. Hold on. I think I'll do a follow-up wind cutter. Oops, wind cutter from here. And then we're gonna do a whoops. We're gonna do a king of beasts to there. And then we're gonna move here and we're gonna pick you up. I think that's fine. We'll see. I may have just screwed everything up. I don't know. We are gonna hold Angel Trainee Flan though. Make sure she's okay. down to eight and that's okay we're good with that all right well we'll have this wrapped up in well this turn theoretically um, try burst why not over here whoops too far over here, we will specialize in the Beast's King. It's fine. And then we shall prep ourselves once more. Boom, boom, boom. Dragon uppercut. I like seeing that uh, Antros is finally really starting to put some damage on people. It does take a specific skill, though. Like, it had to be that skill. The other ones just weren't doing it. Like triple strike and chaos charge or whatever it is, dragon smack, I don't know. So it had to be the king of beasts before he really started coming into his own. Alright, she's at 22. Yeah, we should have this, and I can give it to whomever, whomst ever I wish. She will not do 3100 damage. She actually did way less than I was expecting her to do, which is not great. Uh, I will do it from up here. Attack A! Should be about 12. Oh, okay. And I think I'm going to give it to Zap. I think he has earned his right to become a slightly more powerful individual. 
Don't know that he's got enough oomph to do it, but he's gonna try. Yep, he got it. Angel trainee Flan, get wrecked. Whew, that was tough. Yeah. Don't blame me if you die. You're the one who started it. <laughs> Pretty juice. So, so, uh, excuse me? What? Huh? Oh, oh, it was only a dream. What the hell were you dreaming about? <laughs> uh, Sorry. Anyways, I can finally get my memories back. Hey, where'd it go? <laughs> Boys, Madeiras? Edna, what are you doing? Well, um... <laughs> Looking for this, perhaps. Mm. Oh, when did you... Hey, that person, he looks like God. Uh, no. I get it. You're the one who tricked Flan into trying to kill me. Nope. What do you mean? Don't even think about it. <laughs> Fine. Your plan was to claim that Laharo was still alive. So you could get your memory back while I fought him, was it not? Well, he is still alive, isn't he? Let's Ooh. wait. I already know that you killed Lahar. <sighs> the Overlord and his son no longer exist. Hmm. What? The Overlord is already dead? Hi, Flan. Welcome to the party. Why are you so surprised? God told me that you were the Overlord. Well, I was going to be the Overlord, but that's not the case anymore. You did a fine job, Edna. You've done everything I asked. Yep, now give her her memories back. Which means I have no reason to keep you around. Hmm. What? Give me back my memory! <laughs> we are demons. Why should I show any sympathy for you? You shall regret trying to betray me! Uh, I'm gonna kill you if you do anything to my memory! What am I feeling? What is happening? Ha, you're not even a noble demon! What are you doing here? Is, uh, is, is, that, is that little Edna? Is that little Edna? Aww. And that's a, just a, a zombie. Okay. Huh. What are you looking at? Step aside, common. Look at the noble demons. Look at them. Look at them. <gasps> uh, st stop it! I said stop it! Don't hit young Edna. You sure eat a lot for something so weak. Aw, it's a puppy. I mean, you're eating my food too. Scorlia. I don't have any more food. If you want more, you'll have to steal some on your own. I'm going now. Bye bye. Bye bye. Was that my memory? My my, looks like you could use a hand. Sounds like the Dark Adonis. Huh? Or whatever the new Dark Adonis sounds like. Who is it? Who is it? I don't know. You. How disgusting. Um, excuse me? A noble demon should never harm a beautiful maiden. Let moi, the Dark Adonis Byers, take care of this. Uh-huh. What's happening right now? Jeez, you got some crazy fetish or something? Excuse me? What? It's time for Flan's Q&A Corner! It's not what it says on the tin. Oh boy, there's no way this ends well. <laughs> I've always wanted to do this. Here's the first letter, dude. It's from a girl living in the netherworld. A certain person took my fun away. What should I do? Hmm, that is a tough question. I don't understand how someone can just take people's fun away. Welcome to the internet, Flan. Welcome to the internet. It seems like the netherworld is so full of these sad, evil people. Welcome to the internet. It's so different from Celestia. It's sad how true that is. You just need to teach those evil people a lesson about justice. The dream. You feel that way too, Flan? Uh-oh. Yes! Angels are allowed to get mad too! I'm glad to hear it. Oh, hey! When did you get here? 
Why are you trying to take my fun away? <sighs> scary, Miss Edna. Well, like you said. Yeah. No, I'm sorry. Told you it wasn't going to end well. Alright, let us continue as soon as we save the game. And there it is. Alright. Onward! Back to the castle. No doubt. That demon just came out of nowhere and stole my scene. Uh. It's okay, Miss Etna. At least your precious memories weren't destroyed. That True. just makes everything worse. Why? It makes me sick that I was saved by a demon like him. Yeah, no doubt he stole the show, dude. Mm. I don't know why he appeared, but he just got in my way. He even made that stupid promise. Okay. Vyas? Never heard of you. But if you get in my way, you won't live to see tomorrow. Please, calm down. You tried to destroy the lovely lady's memories, thinking they were worthless. But if you did that, she would never let you get away with it. Yep. If you don't want to die, then don't piss me off. Good plan. It's a good life plan in general. Never mess with that, no? <laughs> what can she do? I'll just destroy her and not have to worry about it. Uh-huh. We have fake Laharl, uh, you know, as a backup. You ain't got nothing, my dearest. I see that both of you are willing to settle this through battle. How about we return here another day to settle your duel? What else? Huh? Why should I agree to that? I just want my memories back. If you fight Madeiras now, you won't walk away unscathed. You exerted plenty of your energy during your previous battle. You're enjoying this, aren't you? Uh. The duel will be held three days from now. We shall all meet at Grand North, several miles north of Madaris's castle. Uh-huh. Why? If Etna should win, Madaris must return her memories. But if she should lose... Yes? Hmm. How about uh, Madaris will become the next overlord? Hey, hey! I will not agree. Really? What guarantee do I have that I will become the overlord by defeating her? There are plenty of others who are vying for that title. Eh. That is a good point. However, she did eliminate the prince, the rightful heir to the throne. I am confident that you would qualify as the overlord should you defeat her. True. And I will also give you this for defeating the young mademoiselle. The what is this? Demon tome? Hey, why do you have that? I, uh, uh I stumbled upon it earlier. Yeah. Yeah. Uh -huh. I think God has rewarded moi for being so handsome. Okay. Miss Etna, why is everyone so surprised? That book is beyond priceless. The demon tome can only be held by the overlord himself. It's proof of being from the royal family. If you have that book, you're basically the Overlord. Huh. Wow! I never knew it was that easy to become an Overlord. Me neither. <laughs> Fool. Why should I wait? I could just kill you all now. Well, you could try. I understand how you feel, but I won't give this up that easily. If you attack, I won't hesitate to toss it into the lava. Have you gone mad? It can make you the Overlord! Meh. You think I'm joking? Huh? Go ahead! Go ahead and attack me! <laughs> <laughs> what is this? Very well. I will adhere to your plan. Okay, you stick to it. By Weird. the way, why did that Byers guy say he was going to give up the demon tone? I don't think he had a choice in that situation. That's what I don't get. If he has the book, why doesn't he make himself the Overlord? He doesn't it's want because to. of love! <laughs> Thank you, Flan. Welcome back. Sacrificing yourself for the well-being of others. It's a wonderful act of love. Demons don't care about love. I know he has something up his sleeve. But I'll play along for now. I need to get rid of Madeiras first. Pretty Squad, are you ready? Ready, dude. Anytime, dude! We still have a couple of days to go. That's the whole point. 
It's a surprise. Yeah. Let's do it, Etna. My, aren't you going to fight fair and square? They're demons, of course not. Of course not. Well, let's go kill this guy already. Yeah. Wait, I'm going with you. What? Angel Trainee Flan has joined your party. Okay. Finale. Continued Chronicles of Etnarnia. Uh-huh. Nice swerve there, giving me a, a two-part finale. Kudos. Kudos. Alright, what do you got to say? Flan, are there many angels like you in Celestia? Yes, why do you ask? I just made a promise to never go to Celestia. Agreed. Do, do, do. It's not easy to stay in the same place like this for a long time. Yes, I know. Thank you for all your hard work. Aw. Flan's thanking the guys. I have a date today. It's almost over. Shouldn't you have something better to say? We're just NPCs. What do you expect? Valid point. You're going to be dumb if all you do is play. Who are you talking to? They know I'm talking to them. Okay. I had a scary nightmare and couldn't sleep at all last night. You're a demon who has nightmares. <laughs> How pathetic. We were dancing around a campfire with some angels. Jeez. Uh, that is terrifying. No doubt. No doubt about it. Zombie! Talk with me. The demons here are surprisingly friendly. That's because we know that fighting only brings sadness. Oh my, I, I see. You must have a painful past. Uh, Flan, you're being fooled. Never trust a demon. Yeah, yeah, no, that's... I don't think we need to go to the hospital, but we're going to do it anyway because of no reason whatsoever. All right, let's go take a peek at where we're at now. Levels-wise. All the way down to the bottom and then bloop. Oh, we have a Flan at the bottom. It's fine. She's going to stay there for now. We have Etna, 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 not Etna, but Etna. We have Etna at uh, 113. We have Planair We're getting closer and closer to 100. She's at 98. Uh, Asagi, whatever, 67. Zaps up to 67 himself. A Bumpy has moved into the 93 range with Katie now in the 60s. Arzla's 103, and Antros is 81. And that's really all that are worthy of note, except for Courtney, who's made it up to 70. Now rivaling a star for top mage spot. Tamlin at 43, and the rest, again, a little bit meh. Don't worry. We'll, we'll level some more peeps up as we go. But for now, let's go. And get stuff done. I have to sneeze. So, let me sneeze. To Jotunheim. Heim, huh? Alright, to absolute zero. What are we doing here? What's the dark durian? What? What is this? Yeah, the duel is until tomorrow, dude. Who cares? It's easy money, dude. Yeah, dude. Getting money for doing nothing is great. And Master Madeira pays us every day, so there's nothing to complain about, dude. Um. Have you heard? Working for Edna's like being a slave, dude. She demands twenty-hour work days, dude, and she only pays when she feels like it. She's ruthless, dude. Who does she think she is? I kind of want to go out and defeat Etna myself, dude. Uh-oh. That, no. Mm. I'd love to shut her up for good. Us Dark Durians are invincible, dude. Are you? I feel like you're not. You guys sure talk big. Huh? Dude! <laughs> you're going to beat me, huh? Don't make me laugh. Even if you were joking around, I'm still going to kill you. But, dude, the duel's not till tomorrow. Yeah, about that. This doesn't look good, dude. Don't worry. We have a powerful ally, dude. You do? Please help us, blessed lady, dude. There's a blessed lady, dude? Finally, some uh, action. All this Antoine? waiting is tiresome. Who? Who's this weirdo? Yeah, no kidding. Miss Antoine, please Antoine. defeat Edna, dude. I was supposed to face a renowned opponent. This is indeed a disappointment. Uh-huh. Who is this meager... Valley girl. Uh-oh. Surely this is some sort of chest. Oh boy. What's gonna happen? Meager? You're about to find out how not all that you are, dude. What? Miss Antoine is a professional assassin from the noble demon class, dude. Huh. She always hits her target no matter what. And she enjoys her victim's death cries, dude. 
Sounds a lot like Etna, actually. Miss Antoine, please use your magnificent super move on Etna. <laughs> Don't die on me too quickly. Uh huh. I wish to enjoy this battle as long as I can. Uh -huh. I don't have time to waste on you. I better make this quick. Your confidence. I shall truly enjoy this. Uh huh. Are you ready? My attacks shall deliver a sweet death. Sure. Look at the prunies. They're what, Dark Durians, though? Yeah, they're Durians, apparently. That's a pretty cool. Well, there's so many of them. What level are you? Oh, God. All right, we're getting into... I might not be able to do this territory soon. We are, we are getting outclassed steadily. It's actually somewhat terrifying. Um, I think durians explode when you throw them. I guess we're about to find out, aren't we? They do. Ow, I hurt myself. Well, that makes things a little bit easier. And by a little bit, I mean, like, extremely easy. Just have to make sure I do this right. I think the Mega Heal will be enough to get you back to full. Nope, I was wrong. Um, do we have more printies over here? No. Oh, we have no entry. All right, we're going to go kill that thing. That's fine. Oh, well, I say that's fine. What, how much health does this ridiculous thing have? Oh, that's going to take a long time to kill. Except I don't need to kill it? Yeah, I don't, I don't care. This is, no, this is fine. I mean, maybe I'll... Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Whatever. Get over here, Etna. Air. I suppose we'll pull Antros out, and I think uh, Slade is going to be one of our MVPs, so probably need to pull Slade out of the old, uh, dust him off the old bench here, or her, I guess. Ah, eh, that's fine, let's start with that. Nothing changed, alright, that's fine. Arzla should probably be part of our crew. Oh, the dog is on a sneezing mission. Zap can join the squad as well. Okay, sounds like her sneezing has stopped. We are able to continue with our adventure here. Um, Leo's probably going to be pretty good to have around as well. Alright, anyone going to move forward? Ah, uh, the Prinny Durian Collective. I don't, I don't know what they are. Uh, they're moving. It's, it's fine. Um... I'm going to say if we pick you up and we toss you right there. It's going to take care of you. I I sort of want to... Alright, I have a plan. It's not a good plan. But it is a plan. Okay, so what we're going to do is this. I lift up whatever your name was, Nitro, Nito, whatever. And we're going to lift up everybody else. And we're going to toss them here. And then we're going to throw you there. And then Zap is going to do that. And it's going to do some damage. Not not a tremendous amount, but a fair amount. And we're going to move here. And we're going to move here. And unfortunately, I can't really go any further than that. So... All right, I got you. I got this. Fine, don't even worry about it. I lift you up and toss you there. It's still not enough. Hmm. All right, can I throw? No, 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 not you. 
Sorry, guys and gals. Let's see if we can't figure this out before uh, all doom and gloom takes shape. There we are. All right, you can move there. I don't know you up there. You can move there. And then you can actually move here. Which is fine. Alright, we're going to go ahead and we're going to lift you up. We're going to lift up Etna. We're going to lift up old Bumpington. And we're going to throw you... try this. There it is. I mean, I did an okay amount of damage. I did murder Zap a little bit there, though. A little bit of Zap murder. I uh, feel a little bit bad, but ooh, we have another person we can bring out. Um, Yeah, I think we should. Katie has made it up into the 60s. She is somewhat viable. Alright, let's do this. Oh, the Pringer Beam's coming out. That's gonna hurt a little bit. Alright, maybe 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 a little bit was an understatement. Ooh. Hmm. You couldn't dodge, man? That's like your thing. Your whole gimmick is that you dodge stuff. did give us the key to defeating this individual, so. Alright, how far can you move? Not quite as far as I'd like, but that's okay. Throw you there-ish. Blow up up there. Really kind of doing a lot of work against her. I mean, I'm enjoying this quite a bit. I'm not going to lie. I don't know that I can avalanche from here. Oh, I can. Perfect. That'll be a pretty tremendous amount of uh, damage. And we, we're going to have to have Etna doing the, the, the last hit here for sure. It has to be Etna. Alright. And over here. I am still a bit sad that we did get wrecked by the, uh, the Pringer Beam. That did make me a little bit, a little bit sad. Throw a heal out there. Alright. Well, the Durians have been defeated. Right, you're gonna come down and hit attack. Oh, that's gonna be unpleasant. It's fine. We have a fairly sizable amount of HP. Let's see if we can't lower that a bit. Yeah, I think that's a little bit less than you had before. Um, yeah, let's do this. I think I'm gonna stick with it till I finish this map. And then uh, this level, this area, what have you. And then we'll break off the old episode. Alright, Etna should have the strength to do this. If she doesn't, I'll be a little bit sad, but she should have the power. And we said good day, ma'am. Ooh, she leveled up from it, too. Nice. Alright, let's get everybody else scooched down up a little bit. I'm going to pick you up and toss you back over by her. And then you get another heal off. Again, improving your stave, your siege. Go with the, the Giga, the Giga heal. And yeah, that'll that'll do it for that turn. And now we have to deal with the remaining imps. 
which seem to be, you know, patiently waiting for us to come and murder them, and I am totally okay with that. No concern whatsoever. Alright. Are you guys ready? You all, you all printed and ready to go? I think we handled this rather nicely. Starting to get worried though, like level 195, that's a bit rough. Oh boy. Uh huh. Can I King of Beast you? I can't. Alright, well, I guess I'm just gonna basically attack you. Oh, I punched Planar in the face. Well, that was the thing that happened. Please don't hit him again. Oh. Well, that was, um... I, I tried to go a little too quick before I really read and paid attention to what was going down. Not not my, my finest moment. D definitively not my finest moment. It's alright. It is okay. Can I... When? No, I need the other spot. All right. Hurricane. I'll finish this. Will you? Nope, you will not. Well. Can you finish this? I'll finish this. Nah. Huh. Not gonna lie, pretty disappointed. Alright, let's go here and hit him with a wind cutter. Bam! Okay, next up on our to-do list, kill the remaining two little swine. Is that gonna hit Planair? Is. Well, I suppose we deserve that. Not gonna lie. We we kind of deserve that for our failure to communicate. It was uh, it was less than great. Let's see if our wind cutter does more than our uh, hack and slash. It's quicker. Nope. Not nearly enough. Alright, well, I will take care of this guy. Apparently, I need help. Whatever, I leveled up from it. I'm happy with that. And we're gonna kill you. One way or the other. Goodbye, Gash. The Long Spear. So we're at level 99 now? Cool. You did! much inner strength. She does. So, what happens now? Are we going to keep this up? Miss Etna. No, Master Etna. I humbly apologize for my actions. Uh -huh. As proof of my respect, may I help you to achieve your goal? Um. Sheesh, that was a quick 180. Why should I trust you? Well, of course, my offer does not come without a price. Uh huh. If you allow me to join you, you shall be granted one wish. Oh? By these pretties. Why, dude, why? You got yourself a deal. They're striking a deal without us, dude. Uh. You better obey your new master. Uh, master Edna. <laughs> and Toir joined. Oh, that's What's interesting. That? For my wish, it's hot. Whatever. Consider it done, dude. They can did you ask grant wishes? Well, that was all very strange. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, that is going to do it for this particular episode. In the next one, we continue through Jotunheim, doing various random things and things and junk and stuff. It'll be fine. We, uh, like I said, we're kind of hitting our, our, our limit to a degree. Like, we're, we're at the very edge, but we're able to do it. We're able to push through. Like I said, I, I would have preferred to have, like, four more people that are, uh, you know, comparable to, like, Arzla, maybe, or even Bumpy. And I don't really have that, so... There's a bit of struggling, but we're, we're going to be okay. We're going to get through it. 
I can't promise you, but I can hope, and that's all I can really do. All right, folks, until the very next episode, my name is Bumpy McSquiggums. Thank you so much for stopping by The Freak Show, and I will see you later. <laughs> <laughs>